Hey, this is Dave coming at you from beautiful Vermont. Uh, it's a balmy 50 degrees here in uh, beautiful Vermont. And uh, headline, resveratrol scam. Is resveratrol a scam? Um, I'm not going to tell you if it is or not. I'm going to give you some information so that you can make an educated decision by yourself whether it is or not. And I'm personally not a physician or a doctor or a scientist. Uh, but I do have this information from uh, Dr. Stephen Cheney, and he is a professor of biochemistry and nutrition at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. His name is over 80 published studies in scientific medical peer-reviewed journals, and he teaches nutrition to medical students at UNC. Everyone seems to have resveratrol products nowadays. You've probably seen them on the news, you probably get bombarded with emails, you've seen them on Google or Yahoo searches, resveratrol, you can get this now little tiny pill and it does all kinds of wonderful things. But anyway, why is Vivix better than all those resveratrol products online in the market? And the answer to the question, he says, is threefold. First place, the resveratrol in Shackley's Vivix is a higher potency, higher purity preparation than many of the other resveratrol products on the market today. And Dr. David Sinclair's studies were a shock to many scientists in the resveratrol community. That was the uh, 60 Minutes report that you saw probably a couple weeks ago on Sunday. He showed convincingly that the amounts of resveratrol one needs to have substantial benefits effect, beneficial effects, were orders of the magnitude greater than anyone ever expected. And clearly one of the two glasses of red wine per day won't do the trick. You're right, like a thousand glasses. Similarly, many of the older resveratrol products on the market just aren't potent enough to be of any significant benefit. For those resveratrol products that are potent enough, many aren't pure enough. All right, there's another problem. This is naturally occurring contaminant in impure resveratrol preparations that has a laxative effect, which oddly enough is one of the questions that I got the other day because I did a testimonial on my resveratrol um, uses and you know what it's been doing for me and they asked me if, if uh, you can lose weight and apparently the reason is because of this other products an impure form that do in fact have a laxative effect and so obviously you can take that product and lose weight it's not like that Unli unless the resveratrol preparation is 99% pure or better many people will find that side effects outweigh beneficial effects Okay? But the most important reason is that resveratrol cannot do it all. It is just one of the many naturally occurring polyphenols, which is why Shackley added a polyphenol blend from the muscadine grapes to, pure, to their purified resveratrol. For example, Shackley's polyphenol blend is high in elegic acid, which is not found in significant amounts in red wine or most resveratrol preparations. And allergic acid inhibits an enzyme that is involved in the formation of advanced glycation end products, that's age proteins, for those of you who don't know, one of the central four mechanisms of cellular aging. Resveratrol has no effect on this enzyme, but does block the other three key mechanisms, mechanisms of cellular aging. Similarly, animal studies su suggest that elegic acid shines in preventing gastrointestinal cancers while resveratrol and other components of the polyphenol blend that Shackley uses in their uh, Vivix formula um, prevents a variety of other tumors. The bottom line is that the adding a polyphenol blend containing elegic acid and other protective polyphenols from the muscadine grape to their ultra-pure, ultra-potent resveratrol Shackley has developed a product that is clearly superior to either resveratrol or a muscadine polyphenol blend alone. This is not a one plus one addition, but a synergistic combination of protective polyphenols that is far more protective than any one of them alone. So I hope that information was uh, informative, and I hope it uh, was an eye-opener for you. It certainly was for me, uh, getting doing some research and finding more about it. And then now, you are educated, and you can make the choice and decision yourself. Is the resveratrol hype 
a scam. You make the decision. Make it a great day and uh, to your health. Keep on when your mind says quit. Dream on till you find your living in. I'll be right by your side. Yeah, baby, keep on. Don't stop till you win.